Hello YouTube, this is this the test and telling you what this is about. Um I see you in the next clip. Okay, this is the next clip. Alright, um reason why I'm doing this video is very simple. I'm actually doing in this video. This one's called Compressors and Silencers. Okay, even though this is a facsimile, just a facsimile of the gun, uh, it still holds true about certain things that U.S. government do use silencers on their guns. So is the SWAT team and stuff like that. And what it is is simply a, you know, sometimes compressors do silence some, some, but not all the time. This is just a facsimile. This is the dummy one also. Um, so is this one on this gun. It's a dummy one. It does not silence. But it does give the illusion of a silencer. And even though it doesn't sound much, but you can see if I go ahead and see the difference in the sound. That's the whole prop. You know, that's the whole thing. If you have to understand that doesn't sound much. Okay, but the U.S. government does use these silencers for wet work, um, going into campment, taking out individuals, assassinations, stuff like that. But, um, but really, you know, for tactical use, that's only what it's used for when you go into places, um, especially encampment. You know, you want to be silent. That's what all this is. Compressors are mainly barrel extensions. They don't really compress anything or the sound. Um, they're just barrel extensions. But now and then you can get a good compressor that will silence a little bit. But in the United States and some states that silencers are against the law. So even though this is a facsimile of the gun 1911, it's just I like having at least the option of when I do train, train realistic and everything. So if I have to need a silencer one day, I can buy one for a real gun, but there's law stippling that you can't do that. Um, that's kind of weird. But how the crap the criminals are getting a hold of it? I mean, they can, you know, like mobsters, they get in a hold of silencer silencers. You know, coming in like gangbusters, popping people. Especially if someone owes them money or drug deal gone bad. <coughs> you know, I just don't understand it, how the criminals get a hold of it, and they still can get a hold of it. Nowadays, it's just a drop gun. Uh, they take a, they shove a potato on the end of the gun, and boom, and drop the gun. They wear gloves and everything. So basically, this is what this video is about. So that's part of the tactical for the day.
realistic terms, realistic wondering, you know, even though tactical guns in some areas are not permitted, silencers are not permitted, you can still have fun and still do realistic training with it. That's it for today.